Can you tell us when these investments are going to start to pay off in terms of the bottom line? Yeah, thank you for having me. Um, look, we're making really good progress on our uh, transformation agenda. We were very focused on returning the group to organic growth. We're up 4% in revenue growth uh, in the second quarter in the first half. By the way, that compares to about minus 4% if you look at our European peers. And if you look at uh, the group, we are very close now to 50% of our revenues uh, coming from uh, non-TV advertising, and that portion is actually growing 12%. We're growing double digit in digital entertainment, in our studio business, importantly in our e-commerce uh, and newcom businesses, uh, and we've just launched uh, Join as a streaming platform. So uh, those are the things that we're focused on our transformation agenda. We are making investments in the business. They are planned, uh, and they're exactly in line with what we communicated at Capital sure. Markets uh, last year. Um, and uh, that will turn into bottom line growth as we look at outer years uh, starting in 2020. Okay, so 2020, that's when the numbers uh, begin, begin to deliver some profitability. Max, good morning, it's Manus. Um, you mentioned the, the new streaming platform, join there. I want to get a sense from you and what kind of lift off, uh, what kind of velocity, to use a Bloomberg word, have you had in terms of the numbers there? Yeah, Manos. So uh, you know, we're six weeks in, but we think uh, pretty good launch. We have uh, 3.8 million uh, users in the first month. We've had 2.4 million app downloads. Uh, and Join is very unique because it's the, the only place where, with no barriers and free, you can get access uh, to TV across 55 channels, uh, you know, with two touches of a finger, um, and it's quite a magical thing. You know, we have, I've publicly stated that we want to get to 10 million users within the first two years, uh, and we are surely working very hard to get to that number faster than that. Max, you've talked about uh, Join being unique, but your rival RTL has a similar streaming service. Wouldn't it make sense to join those two products to compete with bigger rivals like Netflix or Amazon? Um, so, look, we have worked very hard with the public broadcasters. So both ARD and ZDF, so the equivalent to BBC infrastructure in Germany, uh, have actually joined Join. And uh, I have an open invitation uh, to my colleagues and friends at RTL uh, to join us, but uh, that's up to them and not up to me. <laughs> Oh, Max, you just have to sweeten the invitation. You just have to make the lunch more enticing. <laughs> Tell me this. You talked about selling non-core assets. What do you want to get rid of most? Well, fundamentally, we're, we're happy with the asset footprint we have, uh, you know, where we have a very clear uh, and well-structured German entertainment business, uh, where we with Red Arrow Studios have a global content and uh, digital video player business, and with Newcom, uh, you know, we have what will be a one billion leading digital e-commerce uh, portfolio this year. You know, within all of that, there are some marginal assets that are of less strategic fit and so we're always looking at how we can turn those into cash and then use that cash to reinvest into our strategic priorities.